Right, so there are two types of plants that I have very little self-control over when I see them at a reasonable price. And the first is fruit trees uh, that I've never heard of before. And the second is really spiky plants. And this falls beautifully into both of those categories. So this has some commonalities with some other plants I planted. So this is a palm tree, um, evidently. Uh, it is also very, very spiky in a way that the phoenix, which, which I've always thought of as quite a spiky plant, just cannot match. Uh, this is spiky over every surface and when it forms a trunk that trunk will also be covered in spikes it is it is phenomenal how spiky this little plant is and it does bear an edible fruit although it's apparently a bit of an acquired taste it's very rich in vitamin a and reasonably nutritious it's not is very high in fat and and the counts vary uh, between ones that i rely on and ones i don't but they're both citing the same source on whether that is used to make candies or candles um important distinction but as far as i can tell it is edible and a good source of fat this is ifaron i think uh, harder, and the harder just means spiky, because this is not a horrid plant by any stretch. This is this is a beautiful plant, and I love it. Um, it's not going to be getting any companion plants here. This is a rainforest tree, so it is going into quite a shaded spot, which is already quite well planted. Uh, but like the carpentaria, it's a very slender palm. Its stem usually doesn't get much more than 10 centimeters wide, even when it is over 10 meters tall, which is perfect for a nice sheltered environment. It is from a slightly wetter area than we are, so I'm putting it quite close to where the tree fern is, so I should remember to water it quite regularly. And that should be everything for tonight, so thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it, and if you haven't enjoyed it, thank you for watching anyway. Please tune in again tomorrow, because I will be planting something else, um, possibly something less spiky, almost certainly something less spiky, uh, but we'll see.